Welcome to the Career Hub. This screen allows you to manage your career and view information about the season. Let's take a look around. This is the Hub menu. As you move through the menu, the screen will update automatically. If an option needs your attention, an icon will appear above it. At the top of the screen is the race calendar. You'll notice that some races have icons associated with them. These indicate that something special will happen at that weekend. You can view a guide to each circuit by selecting it in the calendar and pressing to view more information. The email system provides you with key information throughout the season, so it's important to check here regularly. That's the key features of the Career Hub. Be sure to have a look around before you go out on track. OK, a lap of Albert Park in Melbourne, Australia. Coming around the last corner to start your lap. Open up the DRS if in qualifying or in the racing situation. Down the main straight towards Turn 1. 175 miles an hour. Look for the left-hand marker boards at the 100-metre board. Break here, down into third. Flick the car in, not too much kerb on the inside or on the exit. DRS open once again, down the back straight towards Turn 3. A great overtaking opportunity come race day into this corner third gear down into second as well for the apex and then up through the gears again third and into fourth on the exit not too much exit curb there hold the car full throttle around turn five feed the car through the barriers 160 miles an hour breaking a straight line under the trees the shadow of the trees makes it tough there don't take too much curb on the exit of turn six itself as it winds around towards turn nine brake at the 100 meter board bumpy into this corner second gear don't let the back get away from you too much as you get close to the wall on the exit towards turn 11 up through the gears drs 180 miles an hour get close to the wall flick the car in sacrifice the speed on the left to open up the right and get a nice exit onto the back straight towards turn 13. another potential overtaking spot coming up here down through the gears from seventh into third not too much exit curb you don't want to waste your traction here and keep the car in a straight line before turn 14 the last fast corner on the track turn 15 watch out for that left front locking up get the car nice and straight again before the exit into the last corner again open up the drs and a final blast of curves as well sees you to the start finish line once more okay a lap of albert park in melbourne Aust Okay, here we are, Sepang, Malaysia, on the run-up towards the last corner.
welcome to the garage. Let me show you around. The car monitor provides you with important information about the race weekend. There's a lot of useful information here. Feel free to check it out later. When you're ready to go out onto the track, skip sessions, or just want to know what your session objectives are, then you just need to ask. you're able to skip sessions. This is useful if you want to jump straight to the next session. The R&D screen displays information relating to the various upgrades that have been added to the car. The guys back home in the factory will be improving every aspect of the car over the course of the season, but you can also help speed up this development by taking part in R&D objectives. Thank <laughs> you. 